Are you in the mood to hear a story? I'm in the mood to hear a story. Use imagination and make connections. Oh, great, because I have a wonderful story today. You know, everybody can, everybody has a use, and, and we can all be helpful to all kinds of different people. And animals can be helpful to each other. Oh, yes, they can. Well, well, what's the story you want today? Well, you know what? We're going to do the lion and the bee story today. Oh, great. You know, there was a lion, and he had walked to the, the river to get a drink of water. And while he was there, he saw a bee floating on a leaf getting its drink of water. Well, a terrible wind came up and blew the leaf in the water and the bee fell off into the water getting its wings all wet and therefore it couldn't fly and it was floundering around and it would have eventually drowned if the lion hadn't reached out with its paw and let the bee crawl onto his paw and he set him down onto the river or the river bank well of course the bee was very grateful and said to, to the lion, Someday I'll, do, I'll save your life like you saved mine. <laughs> and the lion laughed. Oh my goodness, how could you possibly save my life? You are so tiny and I am so great and majestic. Well, the beast said, I don't know how I will do it, but someday I will. Well, days went by and of course they had gone their separate ways and the bee was out getting nectar to make the honey in his hive when he saw a man walking along with a gun and he wondered what is that man doing he's sneaking around so sneaky like and then he saw his friend the lion and he thought oh, I wonder if he's going to hurt my friend the lion and he looked and he saw him creeping closer he thought, and then he saw the man raise the gun up and point it towards the lion. And he knew right away what was going to happen. And so he flew over and he stung the hunter. And of course, the hunter's arms went up in the air and the gun went off and scared the lion. And so the lion ran off and the bee flew after the lion to see where he was. And, and he said to the lion, are you okay? Are you okay? And and the lion says, well, yes, I am, but, but there was a terrible loud noise that I heard. And the beast said, I know, the man was going to shoot you, and I stung him, and he shot up in the air instead of shooting you. Oh, the lion said, my goodness, you saved my life. You really did save my life. Oh. You little creature, you saved me. Yes, just like you saved me, the bee said. So, you see, little creatures can be useful to help out big creatures. Oh, I love that story. Yes, even little children can help big people like me. Sometimes I need help carrying the groceries in, and it's so nice when my little girl helps me. Oh, I bet it is. Ah, oh, well, I'm just wild about stories and illustrating them too. So goodbye for now, and I'll be back again. I'll be back again. We'll be back again soon. Goodbye. Bye.